Hello, and welcome to Vicon Valeris Tutorials. In this video, we'll discuss the basics of playing back recorded video in the Valeris web application, and we'll take a look at the features and functions of video playback. First, drag and drop a camera onto a tile in the monitoring page to open it. Once the camera is open and a live video feed is shown, hover with the mouse over the control bar for the tile control options to show. Press the playback mode button to open the playback timeline and controls at the bottom of the tile. The timeline opens in a 5 minute interval and will have a red line where recording is present and gaps where it isn't. You can use your mouse to move the line further back in time as well as use the mouse wheel while hovering over it to change the display time resolution which will be indicated on the left of the timeline. Note that the video is still showing a live video feed and the blue cursor indicating the current position on the timeline is just ahead of the red bar in present time. Above the timeline, at the bottom right of the screen, there are three option buttons for playing back video. The first button is play from time. This option lets you choose the time you want to start playing back from using a convenient calendar and clock. The second button is rewind which will start playing the video backwards and opens the playback control bar which we will discuss later on. You can turn on loop mode, slow mode, play from time, fast rewind, regular rewind, pause and play, forward, fast forward, live view and go to current time. We will talk about the buttons later on. The third button is go to current time. We will show its functionality later as well. To start playing recorded video you can find the time you are looking for and click on the timeline to play. Or you can click play from time and choose the date and time you would like to view or use the rewind button. In all cases playback will start. Once started a timestamp will appear on the bottom right of the screen and the playback controls next to it. The blue cursor will now show the current playback time on the timeline and will progress with the playback. Playback controls Loop mode places brackets on the timeline and allows the user to choose a time frame to view in a loop and press play. Once brackets have been placed, the blue cursor and playback will keep looping in that time. This is typically used when reviewing an incident and needing to see it over and over without having to constantly rewind and play. Clicking the button again will remove the brackets and return to regular playback. Slow mode changes the playback to slow motion. You can change the speed here by using the fast forward and fast rewind buttons. Note the speed is shown on the left. Fast rewind. Every click will increase the speed. Rewind back to a regular speed. Pause and play. Once the video is paused, the pause symbol will turn blue. To start playing the video in the same direction and speed, press the button again. To play forward in regular speed, press the play button. When the image is paused, the fast forward and fast rewind buttons will change to allow advancing frame by frame in their respective direction. Fast forward. Every click will increase the speed. Live view will return you to the live feed of the camera and the blue cursor to the front of the timeline. Go to current time. If you have moved the timeline and cannot see the blue cursor's location, press this button to focus the timeline back to where your cursor currently is. If you need to play back multiple cameras, you can click on the synchronize button at the top of the monitoring tab. This will make all of the cameras playback synchronize and changing the playback time on any of the cameras will change all of them. Clicking the button again will stop sync. While in playback mode, you can also use the digital zoom option without affecting the recorded video or anyone else viewing the video. To do so, while in playback mode, hover with the mouse over the control bar and click the digital zoom option. With your mouse, click and select the section on your screen or to zoom towards the center of the screen, just scroll with your mouse. You can click the scroll wheel on your mouse to zoom all the way out 
or scroll out slowly with the scroll wheel. We hope this video helped you understand the basics of playing back recorded video in the Valeris web application and all of its features and functions.